Arrived to the Sipasakura Matsuri by Fuji. Fuji San Sipasakura Matsuri. We're so late somehow. The Navi was being really weird. But here's the map. We got free tickets. Yeah, they were like advertising it or something, you see the station. So they have put it, put it all on the wall. And we went and grabbed two, not knowing what it was. And then we got like Fujifan Origami with it. It's nice how you can hear the birds. returning the car here instead of Mrs. Kosugi because the traffic is really heavy and we wouldn't have arrived in Mrs. Kosugi until like half past nine. So we're gonna eat the ramen here.
Right, so we he came home. We came home a bit ago, a bit while ago. A while ago. Yeah, it's half an hour ago. So, but like seriously, I felt like today was such a um, like messed up day somehow. Like we didn't like we didn't head out until like around one, and somehow it took us like three hours to get there, and so we didn't get there until like seriously after four, and it closed at five. I don't like we like I was afraid we didn't have enough time or something, but like we, we didn't really need time there. Yeah, we didn't really need that much time, but because of like how late we were, we couldn't go and do anything else. Like seriously, there was nothing else. We just had to head back, and then we were like heading back to Mrs. Kosugi, and like the navigator was just saying like you will arrive there at half past nine, and we were just like. What the fuck is wrong with the traffic? Like seriously, the traffic was so bad. We had already been driving like for one and a half an hour, and we weren't supposed to arrive until like until after like three hours or something. No, no, two. It was half past. It was like almost seven. That's it was three hours though. Two and a half an hour though. So like we yeah, there was like they started like exactly that day they started doing some constructions around there. Oh, yeah, and it was it was not just that though, because like we already got past the construction part. No, oh we didn't. No. Oh, okay, we didn't get to it. Oh, okay, I we went like... past it. We went to Hatsuyoji to skip the construction. Okay, okay, but it was still like for some reason. Really, so. but yeah, like. So we just called the company and was like, can we just return the car in Hachiyoji? Because there's no way we can make it before 8. And they were just like, yes. And yeah, we had to like pay extra fee because of that, right? Yeah. Otherwise, we wouldn't have made it to the store and we would have paid even more, probably. Because there's like penalty for not returning the car before they close. Yeah. So yeah, we end, we ex that ended up being more expensive to take a car than to actually just take the bus because like, yeah, I think just all in all it's not really worth it to take a car to Fiji unless like you have it overnight or something. Or if you're like more people or something. Yeah, yeah, if there are like more people to share the <laughs> money, I share the cost. <laughs> <laughs> Noah, I'm being with that girl. But yeah, like the Siba Sakura was pretty though. Yep, 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 yep. And we had good ramen. Everybody yeah, we, we used to eat that. And we used to eat it occasionally in Fisinobi. We, we ate it there. one time when we were exchange students, and then one time, like, uh, oh, was that, almost two was years that felt ago. Was that felt yeah. No, it was a bit, it was not only one. We have at least had it like four times before. Four times? I think so. No. I don't remember. It's the best ramen. Oh my god, I was so happy when I was eating yeah. it. It's the first time in a long time. In two years. Yeah, and also just like, I like ramen, but usually I don't get that happy when eating it, but I was so happy eating that ramen. I was also tired, and I, well, I wouldn't say I was hungry, but I was tired, and I was just so happy to eat that ramen. Ah, she was the country. But yeah, I guess we'll just, I'm gonna continue reading my book. 
Oh, one funny story though. We were like on the way home. We were like fooling around, and like she had been teasing me, and I was like pretending to cry. And my parents didn't know was the sky that was coming. I, like I had the nothing against us. Nothing against us. I thought I was really crying, and yeah, he looked surprised and looked like he thought like she was really crying. So I found that really funny. <laughs> so I laughed a lot, mm -hmm. and she started laughing because I told her. Yeah, so he, I guess, maybe felt better. Because I was just like, what? I looked back and started laughing. So I maybe, <laughs> he knew. <laughs> I was just trying to run. And yeah, I'm gonna go read my book. I'm gonna... What's a horror movie? Oh my god. Are you ready? I don't know, I was thinking of checking if Netflix had anything for Stephen King. Okay, I'll maybe watch this if you, if you find something. Hoi. Why am I so ugly? Because you're not. <laughs> At least like this angle. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs>